Hi ladies, Schoon Cup here with a few tips for you when you're on the go. We've got spring break coming up soon, so a lot of us are going to be traveling. And while you're traveling, let's be honest, I'll, there's a big chance you're going to end up in a public restroom. And that could be very uncomfortable and awkward when you need to change your menstrual cup. So I have our Scoot cup here. And this is our little carrying bag, which I definitely recommend when you're traveling, you keep your carrying bag with you. So if you happen to be traveling and you wind up with your period, which tends to happen, here are a few tips for what you can do in a public restroom. The first tip is to just empty it out, wipe it with some toilet paper, and reinsert it. Fortunately, with menstrual cups, you don't have to clean them after every single uh, use if you're still on the same cycle. Although it is recommended you wash it a couple of times a day, um, one or, once or twice a day, to make sure that uh, it's clean. But if you're on the go and you're in a public restroom and you don't have the opportunity to go to a private bathroom at that moment, just empty it out, wipe it down with some toilet paper, and you can reinsert it. If you're someone who feels like you have to wash it after every single use um, and you don't want to leave the stall, then I recommend getting a cloth wipe. The cloth wipes can be useful for two things. One, you can use it as a place to set your menstrual uh, cup when you're in the bathroom. And two, you can use it to actually wipe down your menstrual cup. So if you want to wipe it down, you can use it just to wipe it or you can get a bottle of water, just a small little bottle of water, and you can spray it down. So this bottle right here, is, it's a really small bottle. You can see it's really not huge. Um, my little spray. And you just spray down the cloth and wipe it. Super easy. If you don't want to carry a giant cloth wipe, which really, they're not giant. They're, this one right here is about four by four. You can get a facial round, which is a lot smaller and more convenient to carry with you. So with the facial round again, you would just spray it and then wipe. And lastly, if you really, really want to get out there and you want to use a sink and you happen to be stuck in a stall that doesn't have um, a sink, just go for it. Uh, a lot of times people will think it's really gross and you won't want to go out to use the sink that everybody's using. But in my uh, um, case, there's been a couple of times where I've had to do that and the women that I've, have approached me have actually been more curious than they have been disgusted. So I would just say to go do it. Go out there, wash it in the sink, um, and then pop back into a stall and do your business. And if you are no longer going to be needing your menstrual cup, stick in its little bag and take it to go. So there you have it. Three tips for when you're on the go. If you want to learn a little bit more about this, um, you can check out our blog at schooncup.com slash blog or find us on Facebook at schooncup and Instagram schooncup. And that's all I have for you guys. Uh, let me know in the comments what tips you have for somebody who may be on the go um, and get stuck in a public restroom. What are tips that you would have for them? Let us know. And here's a question for everybody. Have you ever dropped your menstrual cup in a public restroom? <laughs> we want to know. All right. Thank you guys and have a beautiful day.